Hey guys, you're watching Droid Crunch. I'm Lokesh Kapoor, and in this video, we are going to talk about Surface SEO's content editor tool. That is basically for those who want to rank their articles, and we are going to talk about this tool only. And I will show you in action how you can utilize this tool to rank your content on the top of the search engines. So uh, stay with me throughout this video, and you will definitely get to learn a lot. Okay, so let's quickly jump into the content editor tool. So uh, on the left hand sidebar, you can see under the tools content editor just click on it and you'll find this interface you where you can you know type in your keywords on which you want to write the content i will uh, write here um, how to make okay i can say coffee or uh, i probably just did the research a uh, little ago so i can go with some different terms probably so i will definitely go with, uh, take a course to um, google and i will say how to make okay our website resume okay let's do this i will copy it and fine so i will write there the keyword and hit enter you can type in more keywords and this will uh, eventually help the editor to create uh, the terms the nlps terms and all that research for you right there in the editor so let's wait it is taking its time So guys the research is finally done and uh, it is uh, here and I can open it so let's see okay so the research basically tells you uh, about the guidelines like uh, how many words you need to rank how many headings you should have how many paragraphs you can write in the content in order to rank it based on the average paragraphs that your competitors are having for the same keyword okay and the images amount of images number of images that you want to have in your content so as to optimize it for better visibility in the search engines and you can also write there in the terms the keywords based on which you will have more actionable you know to do's uh, list of keywords that you can include in the content and yeah so as you progress writing the content this score will you know go up and uh, it is currently nine based on what we have done so far but as you you know progress it will change okay and it will allow you to see uh, how you are doing basically so here you can take recourse to the uh, terms that can be utilized in the content here you can go in the outline section okay and build the titles okay so it is suggesting me the titles from my competitors i can choose to enter the entire section in my content or opt to choose only the heading or opt to choose only the paragraphs based on my demand or based on my liking okay and here are plenty of uh, you know competitors that i can choose from and i can modify them as well so probably i will go with this how to make a resume step by step guide for any job so how to make a i can say perfect resume i will remove for any job okay so this is my kind of optimization or uh, uh, modification that i did to this uh, heading okay this is h1 so i will do it right there okay and i can make it uh, probably h2 fine so we have title now now let us go to the heading section and here i can choose choose the right resume format here in i can write some intro okay so i will leave this as paragraph okay and i can say here here goes my intro okay i will write in there and here i can choose the headings okay choose the right format list your education uh, correctly okay i can include that as well in h2 okay i can probably add in the paragraphs as well and i can then modify it okay or whatever uh, just to make sure that it just uh, doesn't come into the you know uh, duplicated content uh, you know so that would be very very bad if i just keep it like that you already know it okay so i can easily modify it right there and i can take course to some ai tools to 
rephrase that i can use cool belt and or anything but that is not recommended if you want to do quality content you can easily you know uh research you can see in action what uh, the heading is all about and if it is aligned with the heading you can easily write the content there in the headings without taking recourse to all of these uh, you know uh, possibilities so you can opt not to uh, you know uh, convert the article that is suggested by some resources and write in your own uh, paragraphs therein so that's uh, based on how much time you have to write the content how uh, you know important the content is so it's all about that you can also choose to show the subheadings underneath the underneath this heading and include that as well right so this is like suggestions that you can include in your content right away with just few clicks and here are some questions that you can include and yeah you can do that as well fine so our content is fine tuned in terms of uh, headings subheadings and questions right and so our content score has been improved and it has uh, now uh, improved to 20 from 9 right you can see the details based on the headings it has been improved right now what we need to include in the paragraphs in the content part so here are all the terms that you can include but before we you know take a course to all these terms let me quickly show you this setting section the customized section which uh, tells you how what competitors in surfer is uh, you know taking into account in order to allow us uh, giving all the report or all the suggestions so it is uh, considering this uh, novoresume.com website that is how to make a resume in 2022 beginners guide so it is taking to taking this into resource into consideration okay so if you think that a website uh, in this list is not something that is about blog or something it's a structured website kind of a tool probably so you can easily deselect it and all the terms or sessions based on that website would be gone okay and that's it for this uh, organic competitor six section in the content section uh, structure uh, here all the elements are calculated based on the competitors that you have picked on the top of this okay and the value would be changed and it will affect your maximum content score okay you can also increase it that you want to write more then you can easily manipulate it fine and here are terms that uh, will be included you can also uh, switch between all of these sections by clicking on on them as well fine and you can deselect them as well so here you can you know manipulate all the suggestions that you will get fine you can also select on uh, the topics questions okay the competitors side questions surfer suggestions right and you can also note down something that is important for this article and when you are ready with so this is basically um commanding the surfer seo to give you a better suggestion okay because surfer seo gives you content guidelines but you are you know the are the person who has to command surfer how you know how uh, well it can give you the guidelines right so you can control the quality of guidelines that it can provide to you and you can select deselect the computers you can you know easily manipulate all of this so if you are working with teams and you uh, are the one who has better knowledge probably about seo and all those things then you can create all these uh, you know instructional guidelines and then they can write based on all of this stuff right so when study let's go you can now transfer this article to your team or the person who will write it and or you can just continue with it fine so now we have modified some of the settings and we can see the results these all the uh, terms will be changed based on it right and now when you keep writing uh, this will go green as you use them based on the recommendations like it is recommending is to to use uh, one time okay so if you click on it it is also it will also show how you can use it but sometimes it doesn't show you some examples okay like this fine uh, so currently we have not used any of these terms that would go green okay so let me quickly show you how you can do that but 
it's not that uh, important like i wrote job seekers okay it is showing one time now i just copy it paste it it is two three four five six okay so as i um keep writing or write more about this topic it will go green so it is like if you will have a better content all the sections or most of the sections or most of the keywords that are listed here would, would go green and it will indicate that your uh, article is now good for the seo and it can rank so this way you can assure yourself of the ranking because what sometimes happens that when you you know post an article and if it is not ready for the ranking it just goes beyond the pages like on the six or on the seven page now if you do any changes in that article it can only uh, you know grow to like uh, three four position and that is not good so try to push yourself to write in one go the content that can rank on the google don't post it right away wait uh, stay patient and it can help you have better rankings overall so that was all about surface your content editor tool i hope you enjoyed this video and i'm sure that you know more than me about seo because i was just sharing this tool how you can utilize it but if you are an seo person and a writer probably then you can easily have you know better command and you can have better content that can drink the tool is uh, tested and many people are actually using it even um, you know agency owners freelancers bloggers entrepreneurs many of them are using it confidently and they are having some good rankings on search engines so yeah that is all for today's video so please subscribe to my channel if you liked it and give it a huge thumbs up see you in the next video thank you so much